Morning, good afternoon, good evening, Fabulites. This is Angela with another edition of Notes on the News Feed, where I read to you headlines from my news feed and give you my thoughts about them. My thoughts may be based on je ne sais quoi. They may be based on me having skimmed or read the article. They may have been based on the paragraph following the article. They may have been based on the headline or some combination that I can't understand and can't explain. But you can read the whole headline, the whole article yourself at my Twitter feed, Be Fabulous You. I'll drop the link in the um, description box as soon as I get a chance. And then you can share your own opinions about them. But in the meantime, let's jump in with my notes on the news feed. <sighs> Belle Isle updates. $750,000 grant for Six Mile Trail. Design contest open. More. What Here's what Roosevelt Park could look like in the future. YouTube kills the video, video editing tools you never used. I think you have to have like a million viewers or something to get access to that. I think a bird just flew. I thought they were going to try to come in the sunroof. <laughs> Delta aims to replace boarding passes with fingerprints. Oh, Lord. The, the future is coming. <sighs> Curbed Detroit Pocket Guide, summer 2017. Why three isn't a crowd meet the trio who married each other it may not be a crowd for them that don't mean it's not a crowd for for some people three could be a crowd for for some people most people many people everybody except for them and people who are into that kind of stuff the trump administration put two top climate experts off a scheduled glacier national park tour with mark zuckerberg days before he arrived india musician plays guitar during brain surgery yeah, i guess they didn't want to affect the part of the brain that deals with his ability to play music outcry as chinese school makes ipads compulsory that's interesting because it seemed like if they made tablets compulsory, but to make iPads, that's like a particular brand and everything. Maybe they meant tablets. But anyway, people were upset, so um, I don't think they made it compulsory. Um, so I think after the outcry, it's not compulsory anymore. Microsoft is waging a quiet war against elite Russian hackers. Historic Briggs Mansion in Boston Edison list for just over 1 million. I think I read that it was there were three safes in there, but isn't Briggs now I'm seeing Briggs. Isn't Briggs like an armor car company or something? That's probably why they had, had built three safes into the building. Shoot, in case they had to bring their armor cars there in an emergency and put the stuff in their safes in the house. White owned bar and gentrified in gentrified Brooklyn brags about fake bullet holes. Some, spe some people specialize in fakeness, don't they? I mean, I'm not saying anything. I'm just saying. Nearly seven months later, Toronto cop is finally charged in vicious beating of black man 19 with steel pipe. Steel pipe, 19 year old, that's like a, that's a young man beating. So you take a steel pipe and you beat a young man and you're a cop. See, it's not just limited to, to these United States. <laughs> Yusra El Badger, Yusra El Badger, Sudan's Big and beautiful pills for women. So I guess you take the pills and they make you fatter, bigger, plumper. Okay. Man drives 17 hours for online date with dead wife in trunk. 
Can you imagine you on a date with somebody and you kind of like, hmm, do I like this guy? Do I not like this guy? Could I be serious about him? You know, who is he? What's his heart like? What's what's really going on? And he got the a dead woman in the trunk, his wife. What he going to do to you? You be out here dealing with people. We don't know who they are, but God has blessed us with discernment, right? So we do the best we can and just trust that uh, God is, is protecting us the best way he can, she can, God can. 17 hours. He like, oh, I got a date. Let me just put my dead wife in the trunk that I done killed. Who do that? Here's why we believe that racist killer cop just might go to jail this time. I kind of feel like even if one cop goes to jail, it's a gazillion that haven't. And a gazillion that haven't been um, put on trial. A gazillion where, you know, someone says that they... Um, you know, kill them or beat them or whatever. And it's the cop's word against the black persons. And, you know, I don't know. Is that ungrateful to not just be super, super happy if, if one if one cop killer, if one killer cop uh, uh, gets convicted, does that redeem or does that make anything right? Does that bring back the person that they killed? <sighs> Twitter and uber now both have black female ceos twitter 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 okay i don't know your name girl but come on let's make it work because you know they've been talking about twitter got issues for 29 million years and you know the black people love the twitter i love the twitter through a dial queen sugar explores the effeminization effeminization of the black man is that what they think that situation is about that's interesting i think i skimmed the article um and i think they were talking about the fact that they didn't make it just one it did yeah it didn't seem like it was so much about the effeminization of the um black man but what i thought was interesting as a storyteller um or as as a story that they chose to tell it in such a long way so they were saying, I guess last season on in the first season, baby boy had the dial, but I, I didn't notice. I don't recall Kenya. Um, so I guess it's been kind of like a long, um, thing, you know, it didn't just like, oh my God, he has a dial. Let's do one episode on the dial and it's over. Brian Stevenson addresses poverty, distortion, and racial inequalities. That's a TED talk. Salvador Dali body to be exhumed for DNA test. This is probably old stuff because I've been off, y'all know, for a couple days. But when they pulled the man out the grave, I think his his uh, mustache was intact. <laughs> Don't they say your hair continues to grow after you've made your transition? What's that about? Yeah. May mayoral candidate says Obama was reparations, tells blacks to go back to Africa. Oh, more wisdom from the wise representatives of 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 fool of fucka white tree. <laughs> Activated charcoal works as a magnet to flush bodily toxins. I've never used activated um, um, charcoal, but whenever I've traveled internationally, I have some because people are like, that's what you need to have because if something happened, you need to take that activated charcoal. Like if you get diarrhea or nausea or whatever, that's what you take. That, that's, that's your, you know, you travel with your pharmacy with you. You know, it's some basic things I've learned to travel with and that's one of them. But the only time when I was coming back from India, I got sick on the airplane back. So I don't know what made me sick. I don't, and maybe it was the food on the airplane. I don't know. But I was sick. I was throwing up. It was probably emotional, but it was miserable. I was sick. I was throwing up. I was in the bathroom. I was sick. I was throwing up. I was in the bathroom. How long was the flight? 29 million hours. I was probably sick in the bathroom throwing up for 28 million. But anyway, seeing that article, I'm like, maybe I should get some activated charcoal just to pull the toxins out. 
how race and money stood in the way of a cure for sickle cell in for sickle cell anemia. Yeah, because sickle cell only affects um, basically black folks, right? <laughs> they, ain't, they ain't doing no research on that. But I think I heard or read someplace. Now, I don't want to minimize anything, but I think that I heard that it's something that happens more for black and Mediterranean type people in the in the West than in our native environments or more recently native environments. Teens from Burundi robotics team go missing in USA. Now, I think when I read that article or something, they were saying that the children were defecting. Now, I don't know who defects and how that works, but, um, you know, I think my mother was like, if you defect, you go and you tell somebody you defect and you don't just disappear. Them children are missing. And I was like, oh, okay. I mean, it's six children. It's two boys, four girls. And they, they're teens. They look, you know, they look anywhere from, you know, 15 to 20 or whatever. But, um, you know, just sending love and peace um, to and protection to the children, to the young folks. Alabama man shoots huge wild boar in his front garden. I think that thing was like 85 pounds or something like that. And he had it strung up in the yard after he killed it. And I think he said he had to kill it, three, shoot it three or four or five times. It was, it looked big. Alabama man, shoot, oh, I already said that. New report identifies lifestyle changes that might help prevent Alzheimer's. That's important. I think I saw a news story on it and they were saying like, having friends, not getting depressed. I thought they were going to say stuff like water, don't use aluminum aluminum cooking utensils, um, you know, don't use um, that uh, commercial toothpaste with the aluminum in it. That's what I was expecting, but that's not what happened. But I don't know. I didn't read this article. That's just what I saw. Black woman who was first female bank founder gets a bronze statue in Richmond right next to Confederate heroes. All right, folks, that's what I got right now for my notes on the news feed. Thank you for clicking and sticking around. I'm Angela. The channel is Be Fabulous You. Um, thumbs up. Hit the like button. That's the same as thumbs up thing. Comment, subscribe down below, hit the notifications bell. We're working on 150 subscribers. 150! 150! Um, I think that's all I got. Be you, be fabulous, be fabulous you. Peace.